we have a standing invitation on the podcast uh, for either Comandante Joe Carollo or uh, uh, Mayor Ponzi Bostalita, Francis Suarez, to come and join us. We hadn't heard from them, certainly for for many, many weeks. Uh, Francis, in fact, has been getting his cardio in by running away from the press. I think he, uh, on his Fitbit yesterday, he got 12,000 steps in just running away from Erica Carrillo, uh, Carrillo at uh, Univision. He's doing a spectacular job. But I love how you correct yourself when you uh, pronounce a word Carrillo. Ex- extra gringo. No, Carrillo. but I, it's I know, two but, R's I, and two I, L's, no, but I know, but I like that you got it wrong first and you went back and corrected it because you try very hard to be authentic with this accent, with all, all of your phrasing, but it's hard for you because eres tremendo gringo. I, I have been watching uh, archive footage of Michael Putney from 20, 30 years ago talking about Joe Carollo. And I'm like, oh, no, not Joe Carollo. I mean, it sounds like a we, I appreciate Halloween it. As candy. a Cuban person, I appreciate how hard you try to be authentic in this realm. I, I thank you. Um, and, and, you know, Joe Carollo is very respectful, too. He calls me Billy the Jew. Um, this is not <laughs> inaccurate. Um, tries to pronounce that right. Well, I have news for you, Dan. Mayor Francis Suarez. Is live with us. No. On the phone. He wanted to be in studio here on Ocean Drive, uh, but he told me that he was banned from the Clevelander in 1997. Uh, hello, Mr. Mayor. Uh, thank you for being here with us. Um, thank you, bro. Uh, before we get started, can you tell us why you were banned from the Clevelander in 1997? The Clevelander is the past, and crypto is the future. <laughs> okay. Uh, Mr. Mayor, uh, I guess you're not going to answer that question. Uh, here's another question. Um, city uh, manager Art Noriega suspended the police chief Art Acevedo with the intention of firing him after just six months after he hired him. You touted him as your hand-picked candidate and the Tom Brady or Michael Jordan of police chiefs yeah, just yeah. last April. And the moment he started calling out corruption, which is exactly what he was hired to do as an outsider to reform the department, no. you went MIA. Oh, help, you went, you went, <laughs> refused to comment. You ran from the press. You wouldn't defend your man. So what do you have to say about the imminent termination of Art Acevedo? Well, Billy, Art, Art Acevedo is the past. And crypto is the future. Okay. okay. All right. Look, look, I look, mean, look, this look is Miami's a-, a tech hub, bro. Okay? My, my, my poppy, Mayor Loco, he tells me if I keep saying it loud enough, eventually it's going to come true, right? Tech up. Okay, tech, fine. Let, let's, let me try that again. Let tech, me ask you. Let me ask you about My, cryptocurrency. Miami is a tech hub. Is it happening yet? Is it happening? But let me ask you about cryptocurrency then, Mr. Mayor. How does it? Okay, how does how does it how does it, how does it work? How does cryptocurrency work? Oh, okay, okay, that's right. Let's let's do this, bro. Cafecito talk, right? Okay, yes, cafecito okay, so talk. Bitcoin. Yes. Bitcoin. The way it works is, let's say you got a hundred dollars cash. Okay, so you 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 could put your money in the bank, right? Or right. really. Or you could take, you could buy a hundred dollars worth of Bitcoin. Okay. And then in like three weeks, you sell to three other people for like three times the money. Bro. Okay. And then three weeks later, what happens is they sell Bitcoin for three times the money, and look, and the pyramid just continues to grow. Mr. Mayor, this this sounds this sounds like a this sounds like a pyramid scheme. That does not sound Mr. that Mayor. the way that this is exactly, supposed to work. Exactly, exactly, bro. It's, it's, exactly. It's, it's, it's a pyramid of prosperity. Right. Oh, like, okay. Think of Miami like it's built on an upside down pyramid. Yeah, but that an inverted pyramid does not sound no, like that's a secure not, foundation. No, that's not an economy, Mr. Yeah, Mayor. Why, that's wh- not that's not how businesses and, work. And why do we need why do we need crypto? What can you use it for? Okay, what kind of transactions? Like, what's a, a, a kind of real world application for Bitcoin? Okay, 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 okay. So let's say you're you, okay. You're in club space, right? Okay. Club space is four in the morning, and you need to buy some ecstasy. You, I mean, you you don't want it to be traceable. <laughs> so what, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your cash. You're going to convert it to Bitcoin, okay? You with me, bro? Okay. Okay, so then you're going to pay the dealer with Bitcoin for the ecstasy, and you're going to get a bottle of water. You right, know, De- dehydration, um, and, yeah. And think about it, Billy. It's totally untraceable. But, Mr. Mayor, in addition to being totally illegal, couldn't you just give the dealer the cash, and isn't that untraceable? Cash is the past, bro. Crypto is the future. Right. I almost, I almost forgot. You mentioned that. Come on, Mr. Mayor. I'm beginning to suspect this isn't the mayor. Well, uh, listen, these pyramid schemes can't go on forever. How do you sustain this, Mr. Mayor? Uh, Well, I'm glad you pointed out because the answer is nuclear Bitcoin. Nuclear Bitcoin. (laughs) Nuclear Bitcoin. We're gonna have Turkey Point nuclear reactor. Uh Uh Uh-huh. The 
directly to my tech bro, Elon Musk, about this. And he told me that if his calculations are correct, in order to start the Bitcoin chain reaction, we need a flux capacitor with 1.21 gigawatts of energy. Great, great, Scott. This is Wait, not, great, Scott. This is not all, the mayor. First of all, I think it's nuclear, not nuclear. Exactly right. Nuclear. Second of all, I think Elon Musk told you we need a flux capacitor with a with 1.21 1. 1. gigawatts. That's right, bro. That's right. It's the, new, the Tesla DeLorean. Okay, now, was thing. that before or after he sold you an underwater highway? A Tesla DeLorean? I, you, know, uh, uh, you know, Billy, you can be a hater. You know, uh -huh. That's what you do on Twitter right. all day. Uh -huh. you, know, you criticize. You can mock the underwater highways. Let me tell you something. Mm -hmm. right? By the time Elon Musk and I are done, this whole city is going to be underwater. Okay? <laughs> oh, I believe that, Mr. Oh, see, Mayor. Yes, I believe this, that. This so that right was who's laughing, bro. Okay? No, none of us and are going to be we're laughing. we able to no. mine Bitcoin at the Turkey Point reactor, no. uh -huh. we will no. be the first major metropolitan area in the country to have nuclear saltwater crocodiles with enough purchasing power to buy cocaine. Okay, Mr. Mayor, before we okay. go. Then, what was that? Before we go, I just have one last question, Mr. Mayor. Uh, Joe Carollo, he's basically taken over the whole city. Uh, you, yeah, he, he, he runs, <laughs> he runs the whole city. He's in charge of everything. You have been totally missing in action. This guy has put you over his knee and spanked you and said, who's your daddy? It's not Xavier Suarez. It's this guy, Joe Carollo. What do you have to say once in for all? <laughs> very aggressive. It's a very aggressive interview. Once and for all about Joe Carollo, Mr. Mayor. Uh, Carollo is the past. Oh, for the uh, love of God. And Corio is the future. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. I really appreciate your being here with us. <laughs> okay, you tech, tech hub. hub. You, tech hub okay, bro. listen. You you said you don't think that that's the real mayor, but I will say this: Francis Suarez is a fake mayor. So if that was the fake fake mayor, that makes him the real mayor, bro. <laughs> uh, funny.